got a couple hours before work today. Decided to come down here to the river, see if we can't catch some sauger. I've got two poles out here on the bottom with uh, minnows, and I also have a uh, pole rigged up with a four-inch grub, which I'm also going to be tipping with a minnow. So I'm going to do a little cast and see if I can't catch one or two and uh, see if I can't get something off the bottom. Like I said, I only got about two or three hours before I got to head to work, so hopefully we can get a couple in that time. And uh, I'll get back with you, but we basically got a Carolina rigged minnow on the bottom, large minnow, and we're going to be throwing a four inch grub. And there's the minnows right there. So that's what we're going to be trying. So hopefully we have some luck. Uh, they've been biting pretty good down here, but last time I was down here it was kind of slow, so hopefully we'll get a little bit better action today. Well, we got the first sauger of the day. Haven't been down here 10 minutes, so that's a good sign. I'm going to get this baby unhooked and uh, get my bait back in the water. There's what we caught. Nice little sauger. Just caught sauger number two. Minnow on the bottom. Right down here in Meldol Dam. That one's got my hook in its mouth, so I'm going to have to tie on another hook. But uh, I'm going to tie one on, get it back out there, see if I can't get some more fish before I go to work. Uh, so far it's looking pretty good. Well, we just picked up a smallmouth bass. We uh, got it on a jig, grub, combination. And uh, we're going to put him back in the river for another day. It's a nice one right there though. It's about three and a half pounds I guess. But we've gotten three saugers so far and a small mouth but we've only got about 20 more minutes to fish so hopefully we can get one more fish before then and uh, then I gotta head out to work. So uh, three sauger and a small mouth so far and uh, I'll get back to you later. Comes a barge in the end of my day. I gotta reel them in here in a minute and head to work so I just wanted you to get a look at the barge. Take you over and show you our fish real quick. Got three sauger in there. Three nice ones. Nice small mouth right there. So there's a little chunk there, so we're going to get on down the road here. I said I got to get to work. Unfortunately, I have to make money for a living. So uh, we're going to head on out and uh, get to work. And uh, we'll have to report back another day because uh, just out of time, man, out of time. But the barometric pressure drops. There's a storm coming in. I don't know if you can see the clouds or not. But at any time that barometric pressure is dropping like that, the, the fish usually get a little bit more active. And uh, we've had some warm days. We've got a cold front that's coming in. So uh, watch for that kind of situation. Usually the sauger, the worse the weather, the better they're going to buy it for you. So, But uh, try to get that pressure down. It tends to make the fish more active on the barometric pressure. So we're going to head on down the road here and uh, get to work.